Hello, if you're making ads in 2025, it's a little bit different to what it used to be. Now, when you get to the point where you have to pop in your video or image, it's going to let you upload anything. And then you're going to see a page that tells you, actually, there's these three different sizes that we need. So I have an older video from 2009 that tells you that certain but like certain ratio dimensions for your ad and that's a little bit different now so I'm going to go ahead and show you the three different sizes that you need let's have a look I'm going to just share my whole screen so get excited um, what I have created is a couple of designs already and I'm going to show you how I would go ahead and create this the right size and what you could do is actually create these as templates like canva if you're not familiar is an incredible design tool that makes it really easy for people with little or no um, graphic design skills to make a lot of the different kind of media types that you need in the online business world if you come to the home page you should see something a little bit like this and when you click create and then come down to custom size Let's start with the first one that is 1080 wide and 1920 high. Just type that in and click create new design. And that's going to give you a blank canvas. It's going to give you a couple of things. It's going to give you a blank canvas. And if you click on design, it's going to give you a heap of really cool templates that you could consider using that might work for this now, I have the premium version of Canva, so you may or may not see exactly what I'm seeing. The great thing about these designs are a graphic designer has already done a lot of the heavy lifting for you, a lot of the work. And with ads, I would say it's important to keep it really simple, um, to keep it impactful and easy to read and get the message. So this is one of the sizes that you need and I've made the other two sizes and I've also actually just made a bit of a cheat sheet for you so you can see these are actually the three sizes that you need. You need 1080 by 1920, that's the one we just made. You need the opposite, so 1920 by 1080 and then you also need 1080 by 1080. So I've gone ahead and made all three of those in Canva so you can see. I mean the 1080 by 1080 is just square and the 1920 by 1080 is a rectangle and what you'll see is when you get your content in um, if you've only made one of these sizes it'll say okay this is great this one's acceptable and then you'll usually get like a bit of a um, warning and what you can do is you can crop it using this button which you know invariably end up losing a bit of the content so when you choose crop you can kind of choose which bit you crop but it's still just not ideal. So this is where those three different sizes will come in handy and that will mean you'll be on pretty much all the platform types. You'll be on socials, you'll be in stories and reels and you'll be on the sidebar ads and all those other little video feed ads that come up. So um, yeah, that's it. And again, in each of these, I would recommend just having a look at the templates. It is chaos hour at my place. Um, and seeing what's available there just in terms of the sort of text to size ratio to make sure it's really visible and easy to see um, because with ads like I said you want it to be really impactful and we don't want too much distraction so remember to keep it simple and that will help you get the best reactions and the best for your budget essentially. And I would say that it's great once you've got these designs all loaded up that you give them a name. So this one is the 9 to 16 meta. I may as well call it meta, isn't it? Meta ad templates. And then each time you can just um, reuse this or you can duplicate it. So this one is the 1 to 1. And this one is the... 16 to 9 and then you'll be able to find them you can even just search in your own designs next time so if you put in your designs and you put in meta add and it should show up just those templates that we've created uh, I think pretty much that's all there is to it it's about getting your posts really easy to see um, impactful and 
something that people can quickly take in as they're on the scroll. Uh, if you need any more ads advice, let me know. And if there's any other videos that you want me to make, just let me know and I'd love to make them for you. I hope that video is helpful and I look forward to seeing you really soon.